What's up everyone, welcome back to another video and this video on Git Tour Tips I would like to talk about how to fix the Java error code 1603 on your Windows 10 or on your Windows 11. So let me directly get into a step one by one. So the first one is all about, we just need to go over here, search for the control panel and you have to search over here on the control panel. And right now make sure if it has been set into a small icon you have to change into the large icon. And right now from here the first and foremost step we need to navigate to the java and we have to click over here for the java now from here click on the java over here sorry on the update and also there is an option called update now and you have to go for update now so if it is not updated what happens is it will say it will be updated but right now it says that you are on the latest version of the java which means i'm up to date and i'm fine with it afterwards what we need to do is just go over here and close this and we need to move to the next step Next step is all about what we need to do. We just need to go over here and close this up and we have to go over here, search for the Google Chrome and search for Java download. We have to search here for the Java download. And right now we'll get to this one. We just need to click on this one. And right now go over here, there is an option called Windows Online. So what we need to do is we just need to click on the Windows Online and we have to download the latest versions of the graphics card. I mean, sorry, on the Java. So once it's successfully downloaded, we just need to go to the downloads. And right now, as you can see, this is the download. So I have to run it. And once after, just go for yes. So it will be installed on my system. So just go over here and go to the install. So what happens is the Java is successfully installed on my device. So afterwards, I have to check whether the issue is solved or not. So still, if you're having the trouble, then what we need to do is we just need to move to the next one. Next one is all about, we just need to go over here, let let this get installed in the behind. So I need to just go over here, search for the view advanced system setting. Now from here I have to go to the advanced, click on environment variables. Now from here I have to click on new and I have to click on the browse. And now I have to go to this PC, go to local disk C, go to the program file x86, scroll down and navigate to the Java. Now from here I have to select this particular folder that is JRE. I have to scroll down over here and I have to get into the folder over here I have to get into bin folder now from here I have to check for Java so if I find the Java original one that I'll be finding this is the Java original so I have to select it and go for open and I have to go for once I add it I have to go over here so it is added so just close it and once you add it successfully you just need to click on the sorry you have to go over here just type the variable name java then you have to go over here and click on the browse so now i have to add this particular file so i have to add it so not this one i have to add this java go to open and i have to go for okay and once it is added just need to go for you can find it is successfully added now we just need to close this and we have to check parallelly as you can see i have successfully installed the java as well which is the second step after installing this we need to check next one is all about we just need to go over here search for the control panel and we have to click on this one control panel and right now we need to go over here just change this one to the category and go to the programs and go to the programs and features and right now if you scroll down you'll be somewhere else able to find both java 8 update 451 and the java 8 update 551 which is both the kit so you have to right click on this one go for uninstall and once it's successfully uninstalled we have to close this and go back to the google chrome and you have to reinstall it back and you have to check these are some of the steps that can fix the issue with the java error code 1603 on your windows 11 or windows 10 and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification that's it bye bye